Alright, let's place their sound at the end. You're late. Now, the thing about sound like this, I'm always a bit... Kind of depends what you want to do with it. It's just for an exercise, fine. For a reel, it's very subjective. But I always feel like there's no sound and suddenly... And then nothing. So you got music, a bit of, of a line, and then that's it. This would be so cool if you had something similar. And it's tricky because you, there's music too. Or some ambient sound that I don't know if you can replicate it somehow. Find something to, to bridge... You know, that gap somehow. That's just the, the picky side for me in terms of sound. You're late. You're late. Especially late. Like, even if it's the last work, it's really cut off. You're late. But, apart from that, I think... Turn the sound off. I mean, this can be done in many, many ways. And in terms of your email here... You want to convey the message that he's angry. My thing that is more like a question for you. Like, if you look at him here, like, I like all this. He's got nice poses there. Setup is interesting. And when he does this, I love in your reference, which is awesome. I'm not going to put it online since you mentioned uh, I can post this on, on the channel. Like, you have a really exaggerated where it's more like lips out from the side. So you have to kind of decide how cartoony you want this to be. This seems less exaggerated than your reference. And your reference cracked me up. And you have to look at this. Going over there is a really big move. And then it comes back. And then we have this to that. So my question to you is, like for me, it seems like, where do you want to put the emphasis? I almost feel like this is the big thing. There are two ways. You can make this really big like this. And then it can almost stay there leaning. So that when he brings this out, he's not yet leaning with the, uh, out with the gun here forward. And you make this a more of a subtle reveal of... Yeah, this is the dangerous part, right? So you have a big contrast of big move. But then the gun reveal is a, actually a lot smaller move, so that it's almost going against type, where you would think that I got a gun, now I got to boast and move big and intimidate and be intimidating. This would be the small move, or you keep this like that, and he just turns the head with a slight lean, really cranes the neck forward, lips out to get this, and he's trying to look at him as much as he can because you know he doesn't want to keep him out of sight. And after all of that, then comes the big move that you have here. So maybe this will be, you know, maybe that whatever you have here will be here. I know we start covering the hand, but there's something to think about where maybe this move is small, big at the end, or big move, small at the end. Right now, to me, everything has kind of the same energy. Because it could also be something where he kind of goes, and he can even put his tongue out to latch around this so then it, it pivots off of here and he only has to go so far then you get a bit of a wobble in there it just also kind of depends how cartoony and exaggerated you want this to be like you know or how serious this is supposed to be it seems a bit less angry here with that expression but to me it's mostly that they're still on step you got some some you know poppy poses especially this like there's so much you can do with that, this is going to take a lot more time. This is going to be a slow reveal where he brings up the arm like this and we see the gun and then that thing gets longer and longer and longer. You know what I mean? Like it's not like he has to pull this arm really high up here to reveal the full length of the gun and then he turns it. Or is it something where he does this, starts to lean back and the wrist kind of rotates around, keeping the gun somewhat hidden. And then at the end, it's basically just goes up the, the barrel goes up like that that's the reveal there's many things you can do in terms of how this is going to be the big reveal or he brings it out and it's here and he does that i mean you can also do technically you can do this closes his, his eyes <laughs> slurps and i would still probably tilt this a little bit over to give, give some life there slurps it and while he slurps it he actually takes the gun up there's so much room now the gun barrel has a lot of room, so you don't cover the face. 
and then the gun ends up being in this position while he's still slurping, right? And then he's done, and then he moves over. So it's like a one, two, gun reveal three into last position, and then five in there. I don't know. Like, so to me, my critique is more, there are many things you can do with this. None of them are right or wrong. <laughs> These are just all different things. So I think just for you to decide how far you want to go in terms of the cartoony aspect of it, exaggerating things, how how silly you want it to be. What's the emphasis? It's just, is it going to be just this happens to be there and it's more about the dialogue that's here? Do you want this to be a big moment? I don't know. So to me, it's more like, these are the questions that I would ask yourself in, in order to give this a bit more punch and a bit more contrast. Because again, to me, it's like, that's the big move. It's fun. And then you have a big move here. They seem just equally weighted. If that makes sense. Hope that makes sense. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm going to leave it at that. And uh, let me know. We can always, as always, chat about those things. These are not submissions when we're just chatting about ideas. But Because other than that, I'm not worried about your animation. You have a lean... Maybe on that lean, you could lower that shoulder a bit more and raise this one just for more contrast. But, you know, you has a lean. He gets up there a little bit because he has to make room. Like, all your mechanics to me seem on point. And he has a nice lean there. I like all of this. This up there. These are some nice poses. All this is clean. I mean, like, all of this works. For me, it's more about what's the emphasis and what's the style and, you know, Where's the humor or not? Like, what do you want to do with this? All right. Thanks. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.